I'm gonna play the G3. I'm gonna play G3. I'm gonna open with the G3. My favorite openings would probably be G3, B4, or C4. My opponent chooses to go straight to the middle. Pawn to D5. He plays pawn to E6 to defend pawn on E5. I'm gonna play pawn to F4. I'm gonna play pawn to F4. What I'm looking for is to gain control of the four squares C, D, E, and F. I'm looking to control those squares on the fifth row, on the fifth rank. Um, I don't want to block in, so I'm going to play pawn D4 in response. He's moving a lot of pawns out. Um, I'm going to be ahead of time with this. I'm going to just stop him from bringing bishop all the way down here to e4. He plays bishop to b7. Um, and this is where I want to bring my knight to g to e2. And I'm looking to castle on the king's side. Um, I'm looking to castle on the king's side. I'm looking to occupy dark squares. Um, so, I could throw in a dirty check, but it would only bring his pawn forward. I want to go ahead and bring queen out here, g4. And if nothing happens to defend this pawn on e6, then I'm going to put in a check and I'm going to have some really good looking game plans. This all depends on what my opponent's trying to do though. These pawns can be very irritating, the way he has them set up for this kind of formation. They can be very annoying. He plays queen to defend, which is the best idea here. Um, and now at this moment, I want to defend this lane with bishop to d2. Like I said, I really don't want this dark square bishop on his side to come down on b4. I don't want him anywhere here. So he comes in. And I'm going to put my bishop, my knight, on e2. And afterwards, I intend on castling. What does he want to do? He wants to move my queen. He wants to move my queen. And I'm okay with that. I'm going to bring my queen to f3. I'm going to bring my queen to f3. I really don't see him... Oh, okay. That's an interesting move. Um, what would one do? I'm going to let him come in. I'm going to let him come into this little setup I've gotten. I still want a castle. I still want a castle. I'm going to play pawn c3. And he's probably going to push that pawn into e4 and move my queen yet again. And that could be problematic. I'm going to be very cramped if he does that. Yeah. Ugh. I'm extremely cramped right now. Okay. I'm going to throw in a check here. I'm going to throw in a check. Now, if pawn push... Okay. Yeah, I didn't expect to see a pawn push. Um, I really want a castle, but at the same time, I'm heavily leaning towards pushing pawn from g3 to g4 just to stop this queen from coming in at some point. I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. This is strange. 
I'm a little worried. I'm a little worried. More breathing room, I believe, is in order here. I'm going to push pawn to h3. And now here comes that pawn. If I'm not careful, I can get my queen killed. <laughs> and that would not be good. Now it wouldn't. Um gonna have to play queen here to h4 these dark squares don't look so appealing at the moment <laughs> don't look so useful not so good looking um, and my queen cut itself off, so... Alright... I don't want to drop that. I'm not dropping that knight. So... This knight is going to have to come here... To see... One. Jeez, I can't believe how cramped I made myself just now. Um, jeez. I need to push pawns out. I need to get this left side working. Very bad on the left side. Very bad looking. My queen is off the middle of the board. His isn't. And that's why his queen is much better than mine at the moment. That needs to change very quickly. So these are the problems that I'm currently having with this game. What do you want to do, sir? What are you looking to do? What's interesting for you? Okay, so he wants to bring his bishop. He really wants to bring that bishop. I don't want him to bring that bishop. So, if he takes... I'm going to probably ah he's gonna push pawn to c4 I predict um, a loss here unless maybe I play bishop to f1 and uh, get rid of that light square bishop he's got So, 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 my friend, what are you going to do? Please, tell me your plans. That'd be awesome if you could just go ahead and do that. Just tell me everything that you're about to do. Okay. Now I can get a check if I can move this knight here. Gain a tempo, maybe, if 
this knight move so I can gain a tempo. Okay, so he's trying to block me in. Don't know how much I appreciate that. I want to play this. I want to play bishop to f1 and get rid of this other light square bishop. He's very annoying. Very, very annoying. I don't think I've ever been so cramped. What is he looking for? I'm gonna try to take this pawn away from that square. I want that pawn off of d5. Horribly, I need him to go away. And at the moment, he's going to start giving me things. I think he's breaking down. I think he's giving me a lot of opportunities he shouldn't be giving me. Um, what does he do now? What do you do now, my friend? What can you do now? Is he giving up? Really? What's going on right now? I'm so confused. I am so horribly confused. What are you doing? My next move should probably be light square bishop to d4, d5 actually. Um, he's trying to checkmate my queen, but I don't want him to, and therefore I'm going to start throwing checks in his face. Come on, my friend. Come on. Well then, I just want a queen. Doesn't seem so bad. And if he doesn't move his king, he's looking at a checkmate. He just, he completely ruined it. He was doing, he had a lot of space, I believe. I feel like I had nothing. I feel like I had absolutely nothing in the middle of that game. And I believe he's still in checkmate. No, he's not in checkmate. Um, wish he was. I'm gonna open up a discover check and attack this rook here on d4. On d7, actually. Queen, e4, just 
keep checking this king and try to get him away from his defenses. Very good bishops. I love my bishops right now. My bishops are awesome. I'm loving my bishops. Yeah, he's walking into a mate. Very nice. Okay. I could deal with that. And now he's stuck on a8, and I'm going to bring queen to b7, and that's checkmate. Very nice. That went well. There you go. That's a pretty good game, I think. Went a lot better than I thought it would. Anyway, um, this is Billy. Um, low rated chess for the win, right? For the win. Um, so just please subscribe. Thank you for watching the video. Tell me what you think in the comment section. Have a good day.